Today we're going to talk about the three steps you need to maximize your law firm wealth and build your empire. <clears throat> so how would you like to maximize your law firm profit and take your firm to the next level? In the short training, I'm going to share with you the three biggest mistakes most law firm owners make when it comes to having a profitable law firm that maximizes the owner's wealth, the three things that profitable law firm owners have that firms stuck in the dungeon do not, and finally, the simple proven three-step system that gives you a clearly defined vision for where you are going and how you can start putting this work, it, putting this to work in your firm right now. A little bit about me. <clears throat> My name is Jessica Gonifus. I'm a CPA and a business growth and profitability advisor. I work specifically with law firms and law firm owners who want to take it to the next level. <clears throat> I do help law firm owners because I know firsthand what it's like to be a small business owner. And sometimes, just sometimes, it isn't the life that you may have dreamed of. <clears throat> so who's this training for? Law firm owners with at least 300000 in annual revenue. If you are stalled at your current revenue level or unsure how to get to the next level, you know you're capable of reaching six, seven, or even eight figures, but you don't know how. And you consider yourself a go-getter and you know that you need advice and support to reach your goals and move to that next level. Okay, let's dive in. You're in the right place if you're struggling with one or more of these problems. You feel like you're not making your big goals happen. You feel like you are not getting the expert support that you need to build the law firm of your dreams. And you're not seeing the success you know that you are capable of. Now, in the lawyer profession, I'm sure you all have seen firms fall into one of two categories. The first category is what we call OCD law firms. These are law firm owners who are overwhelmed, confused, and discouraged. They keep on doing the same thing over and over again out of habit, thinking that one day things will magically or miraculously change, but they really are stuck in a loop that they cannot get out of. This is what this looks like if you are stuck in this place. You feel like you might be flying by the seat of your pants, lack any vision for your firm, you can't seem to get past your current revenue level, your firm may be growing, but it is really lacking strategy and you aren't making enough money to support your personal financial goals. The second, time of law, second type of law firms that we see are what we call our empire building law firms. So these law firms have happy owners, they love what they're doing, and they're building personal wealth, and they have freedom. So how can you move from OCD to empire building? You need a clearly defined vision for where you are going with your firm. You need to have the courage to take calculated risks necessary to reach your goals. You need to have financial support from experts in law firm growth. You need to support, you need support and accountability from folks that know how it feels to be in your shoes. And you need to have confidence in your financial numbers. So what is it that enables some law firm owners to be paid their worth, have freedom and build wealth while other firm owners seem to struggle to have confidence in the direction their firm is going and fail to have a personal life. So after working with many, many law firms and being a small business owner myself, I've seen firsthand that empire building firms have one key strategy dialed in while OCD firms skip the strategy altogether. And that strategy is planning. When you nail your planning, you are running your firm instead of your firm running you. You feel confident making strategic moves to reach your goals. You know what your vision is and the steps needed to get there. You know when course corrections are needed. You have pride in the firm that you are creating and you are truly building your kingdom into an empire. So what is strategic planning? This is also another Definition of planning. You're setting goals and creating a blueprint for an organization's future. So how do you create a strategic plan that actually works to help grow your law firm? 
Today I'm going to show you three really cool empire building accelerators. The first of which is getting clarity. So let's imagine you're getting ready to plan a vacation. You wouldn't just show up at the airport and find any flight. <clears throat> you would go through some process to plan your trip. The first step would be figure out how much money you have to spend, how much time you have to take off from work. Then you would start choosing a location based on what you do or don't want to do. Then you would put your plan into place, your dates, your locations, etc. Getting clarity for where you want your firm to be in the future is very similar. You need to understand where you are today, then outline your vision for where you want to be. If you aren't doing this now, you have left for the airport for your vacation and have no idea what you are doing other than going on vacation. So let's talk about Steve. Steve is one of our clients and through working with us, he made significant improvement in his firm's profitability very quickly by getting clarity surrounding where his revenue was coming from and where he was spending money in his firm. Prior to working with us, he was confused and lacked the confidence in his current numbers. After working with us and creating his strategic plan, Steve was able to consistently show profitable months in his firm for the first time in several years. The second growth accelerator is designing your strategy. So let's go back to the vacation example. When you gained clarity, you figured out your vacation budget. In other words, you established your current baseline and you knew where you were going. You established your vision. Now that you got super clear on those two pieces, you were now ready to put the how behind the vision. This is where you determine how you are going to get to the vacation spot, what hotel you will stay at, when act, what activities you will do, etc. This step is critical to ensure you are taking action to make your vision for your firm a reality. We all know people that talk about things they are going to do in their life, but none of it actually happens. If you are not developing a strategy to reach your firm goals, you are one of those people. We have a client, Michael, <clears throat> when he started working with us, he had a good idea of his vision for his firm, but he really struggled how to realize that vision for the past few years. We created his plan for this year by not only setting his financial goals, but setting quarterly goals and objectives that he needed to accomplish in order to reach those financial goals. Michael told us that by knowing his numbers and projections, it gave him foresight and insight and confidence to work smarter. He more than doubled his revenue and had the best January that he had had any year in business. He is now on track to have the best year in business ever. And the third growth accelerator is catapulting our performance. So in this area, you must have in place to grow your firm the right way. You have to measure it and monitor your performance. <clears throat> so within, the, within any area of our life, we set goals. We have to monitor and measure our progress. Take running a marathon, for example. You set the goal to run it in a certain amount of time. All the way along as you are preparing, you are timing yourself to see how close you are getting to being able to reach that goal. Growing your law firm is really no different than this. If you wouldn't set a goal to run a marathon in a certain amount of time and never time yourself while you are training, you should not be setting growth goals for your law firm without checking in on how you are progressing toward your goals. We have a client, we're gonna call him Edward, and he works with us at the CFO level. He had the first quarter, his results were not where we wanted them to be. His revenue had increased, but his expenses had also increased. So we were monitoring the profit very closely. And in this example, if we would have just lifted his revenue, he would have had stellar numbers and was meeting our goals. But because his expenses increased also, his profit margin was not where we wanted it to be. So we had that discussion because we were measuring and monitoring his performance and how close he was to meeting targets. 
and he was able to make adjustments in the second quarter and now he's on track to exceed his goals for the year. So the reality of all of this is if you don't create a plan, monitor your performance and monitor your performance, your firm is not going to grow in the direction that you want it to and you will continue to feel like you are flying by the seat of your pants. So how can a firm move from OCD to empire building? We're gonna have clearly defined vision for where you're going with your firm. You're going to gain the courage to take calculated risks necessary to reach your goals. You need the financial support from experts in law firm growth. You also need support and accountability from folks that know how it feels to be in your shoes. And finally, you need to have the confidence in your financial numbers. These people are the firm owners who love what they do, have crazy profits, and build personal wealth while having freedom. Now you must get your strategic plan in place and generate the results like my clients have. You can choose to do it the hard way, which is continue to do what you've been doing that isn't working, possibly try to create all of this yourself, teach yourself how to be an accountant and how to do financial projections, that's definitely an option. Or the easy way would be working with us. And we have a process we go through that we talked about earlier in those three key steps. And what we end up with for our clients is they really have wealth, pride, and confidence in their law firm and in their growth patterns. So my dream clients are folks that are go-getters, want to grow, want to have work-life balance, want to be an entrepreneur, law firm owner, and they have big dreams. So there are really three types of firm owners or partners that we are looking for to work with. So firms that want to grow, willing to make strategic investments to ensure they are creating a law firm that will serve as a legacy. Firms that want to be confident knowing where they are going and how they will get there. And firms who want to dramatically increase their profit margin so they can ensure their law firm is providing for their personal wealth goals. The next step would be to book a strategy call. This is the process to get started. We will focus on a specific and custom tailored strategy and execution to help you solve the biggest problems that most law firms face. And I love this quote, failing to plan is planning to fail. So this very, very valuable meeting will take about 30 minutes. You'll be speaking directly with me. We'll be helping you identify what you already have and helping you to put together a plan to ensure that you are building your law firm kingdom into an empire. So who is this for? Law firm owners who are already in business and making some sales. Law firm owners who know they are good at what they do and they truly believe that they can make a difference in people's lives and make a high six-figure, seven-figure income doing it. It's also for lawyers who want to dominate their market and become number one. But you must be willing to have some skin in the game and understand that you need to invest some money and time to grow your firm and take it to the next level. Who is this not for? People who make excuses and complain. People who are stuck in the information gathering mode and they're not prepared to take action to get results. Anyone who's not serious about growing their business by another hundred thousand to one million dollars in the future. And people who are not prepared to stretch themselves and step outside their comfort zone. For me, the better the fit, the better the results. I'm looking for a win-win for both of us. So this is a custom tailored one-on-one -on -one strategy call with you and me. This is where we really begin working to figure out what you want and how to make it happen in the fastest time possible. I do have to issue a warning here. We currently only work with 25 firms a year on this strategy and we do run on a first come first served right fit process. So book your call today so you do not miss out on this opportunity. And you can book your call just by clicking below this video. Thanks for watching and happy, happy empire building.